One of the greatest joys of adulting is taking long, hot showers. Your glasses get a little steamy, but you could take them off and, unless you want to find the soap. The only problem with long showers is that they can waste a fair amount of the H2O that can be in short supply. Well, now there's a smart shower head that can lessen the flow if you're not right below. Here's Allie Ward to explain. What idea did you last dream up in the shower? This is inventor Evan Schneider, CEO Chi Wang Tang, and COO Ted Lee. And together they engineered a whole new shower experience called Awaysense. I wanted to immerse myself in this story, so I met the team in Emeryville, California. Did this idea originate during a shower? Did you think of this during a shower? Yeah, it was around 2015 during the California drought. Everyone was realizing that every drop of water counted. So the idea of a Navy shower came up where you turn off the water when you're using shampoo or soap and only use water when you rinse. But how could we make that easier? I've never heard it called a Navy shower. When you're on the ship, it's very important for you to conserve fresh water. So have it be intermittent instead of just a trickle the whole time where you're half covered in suds going, I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> Set it back. And it should be off. Yes, fantastic. Good job. Guys. Using Chiwei's garage as their early home base, they made sure the look and installation process were identical to a traditional shower head. First thing you do is you turn on the water tap mixer, you wait for the water to warm up, and then basically you just step in and enjoy a high flow rinsing experience. When you step out lightly to shampoo yourself and soap up yourself, the water reduced to about 15%. Amazing. Their design had to accommodate sensors, the power components, and the generator, all inside a metal enclosure with powerful nozzles. And how do you figure out what sensing equipment needs to go in there? The sensor we put together has to be able to see through fog, and we end up having to fuse multiple sensing mechanisms together, running a fusion algorithm and also self-learning software behind this to govern everything to get the precise sensing experience. We have 12 volts. So tell me about how you made the jump to using a turbine inside of a shower head. That's so cool. When you're thinking about what power is normally in a shower, there's a tremendous amount of water flow at high pressure. And so that's where the idea of a turbine came up. Based on their research, the team at Oasense found the average length of a shower is about 8.2 minutes. How much does your shower head save on average per shower? If they're motivated, like most of our consumers are, they can easily save 40 to 60% of their typical water volume by only using the water when they need it. Oh, that's so much. So next time you daydream in the shower, take notes. Those negative ions may inspire innovation, imagination, and impact.